The hills are alive with the sound of engines. It's race day here at the Austrian Grand Prix. It's one of the shortest laps on the calendar today then, with seven rights and just three lefts, making up the ten corners of this high-speed circuit. Turn two is barely a corner at all. They'll be flat out through there, a left-hand kink into the uphill braking zone of turn three. Turns one, three and four are all potential opportunities to overtake. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Sergio Perez will lead us away from pole position. And it's Charles Leclerc in P2. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Sainz, Hamilton, Max Verstappen and Russell, Magnussen, Bottas, Fernando Alonso and Yuki Tsunoda, Joe, Gasly, Mick Schumacher and Ocon, Vettel, Norris, Nicholas Latifi and Alex Albon, Ricardo and Lance Stroll brings the grid to a close. And now it's time to head down to the track. Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box, and it's fantastic to have you with us here, but I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? Well, I imagine they'll be starting to feel the adrenaline as they anticipate the rundown into Turn 1, a bit like preparing to go into battle. The unknown situation will bring nerves, but that's a good thing. It will keep them focused on the moment and on their surroundings as we build towards the start of the Grand Prix. OK, here we go. I know what you can do. Don't let me down. You made it look so easy. now enables, DRS enables.
Okay, this is your final lap, final lap of the race. team effort then to secure victory here in the Styrian Alps. What do you think it was today, Ant, that gave them the edge over the competition? I really feel the track layout combined with the track temperatures we saw today suited their car. These cars come alive when the tyres are just at the right temperature and the driver did a great job managing that as well. They just look so comfortable out there. It's like anything, it always looks so easy when it all just clicks. Red Bull are our winners today after showcasing some incredible driving. There's been a huge push from them lately to stay competitive with the other teams, and they're certainly proving themselves. Well, after an incredible day of racing, who was your driver of the day, Ant? Max Verstappen seemed to just effortlessly weave through the other drivers today without a care in the world. He was definitely my driver of choice. Well, what an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one.